Hey y'all, welcome. Welcome back to Artistic License. We have to do the stream backwards today because Lady is incredibly hyper and keeps climbing all over my stuff. So I'm trying to play with her with my thick socks. <laughs> Come on, Lady. You need to get tired. You need to get tired so you can lay down and be cute. <laughs> How's it going, guys? No, get back in frame so at least they can see you. Come here. Come here. I think she might be actually starting to get tired. Welcome, Kitty, by the way. Welcome, Koneko. Welcome, Joe Bloody. I'm so glad you're back today. We're doing some more Pokemon today. Um, right now, we're playing with my real-life Pokemon, this crazy little kitten. <laughs> she keeps, and there she goes again. She's trying to climb on the computer and turn it off in the middle of the stream. I know that's what she's doing. She's done it before. Get back. Get back. No, get back. Kitty cat, I swear to God, you guys, I swear to God. Okay, I also have for you guys a dice update. So, I finally got a mold that's working. I've been really struggling. As y'all know, lady, don't go back there. Come on, you stay here. There you go, play with that. Um, I messed up the D20 though, so I'm recasting that. But I finally got something with no raised faces and they look really nice. So here we go, I'm gonna show the D4 and the D12. So autofocus, do your thing. There we go. Block, try to block my face. There we go. You can see it somewhat. I feel like when I block my face. Yeah, so like these actually look good. Like this is the face that it was cast on and it's not like raised or anything. Like that's the open face. Like here's the D12. You can see when I block my face, then I can't see the screen. Okay, there we go. Now I got an angle where I can see it. So you can see like how it's come out. And again, like the one face, it's not raised or anything. So I finally got like something that I think is kind of working. Thank you. Thank you. So hopefully I can recast the 20 and it'll come out good. And then I'll have like my first real set that like actually is is set up how I want and all of that stuff with my masters and oh my gosh there's been so much trial and error but hopefully I've got something now that works I will find out tomorrow morning if that's the case <laughs> yeah yeah I think they look really good I love this design I think I'm going to do some more combinations with some more colors like I want to do a blue and a purple as well um, you know, seeing like some colors that are more close together, how it looks with that, because red and green, of course, is quite contrasting. Um, so I want to do some more with some closer together colors and see how that goes. So that's this week's dice update. Lady is trying to eat the baby cam now. She's never been interested in that, but that's what she's going for, because I won't let her back to climb on the computer. No, don't go back there. Don't go back there. Come on. This kitty cat, I swear. What, you need more attention? You need more attention? You need more attention? Come on. Are you too tired? Well, then you're too tired to mess with my stuff, okay? She looks so sad. She looks so sad, like I've done her wrong. Okay, I'll turn on the baby cam. Let's see, there we go. It's even pointed at, straight at her. There you go, perfect. Now you've got two angles, two angles of little lady. I know, but then she gives me like the slow blink, like she's ready to snuggle or whatever. She's probably playing with me. She's probably playing with me. All right, you guys. It's quiz time. Quiz time. Excellent. We're going to find out which female artist would bully you in high school. Oh, hang on. The chat box is really low for some reason. Can't see the bottom. There we go. All right, we're gonna find out which female artist will bully you in high school because today we're gonna be battling Erica in our Nuzlocke. So I thought this one would be good. No, I don't, no, go away. I don't want to save a password. I didn't even put in a password. All right, <clears throat> what do you like to do when you're not uncontrollably sobbing? Oh, play Pokemon. <laughs> uh, art shop, be annoying on the internet. Oh, I like that one. Inflict never ending pain on others. Only fictional pain. Uh, write, cry more, or dance. I like to be annoying on the internet. It's my favorite. Okay. If there was only two minutes left to live, what would you do? Hug your parents, read Wattpad Smut. 
<laughs> Pray, jump out of the window to get it down faster. <gasps> I want to be the cool kid and say read Wattpad smut, but I'm going to have to be real. I'd hug my parents. I'd probably really hug my husband first, and then if I had time left over, I'd hug my parents. What is your gender? Girl, boy, non-binary? I don't know. That's fine. <laughs> Oh, these are good answers. These are good answers. Um, can I put somewhere in between girl and non-binary? That's kind of how I feel. I think we'll probably choose girl, though. I think that's probably closer. Got my result. I went zoomies through this one. Oh my gosh. Well, you'll have to tell me. Lady, you are banned from back there. Pick up these dice before, before she decides to play with those. Lady, excuse you. Okay, she jumped down. Sorry y'all keep getting close-ups of my forehead. <clears throat> Alright. Do you see things? Just making sure. Yes, I see things. I do. Have you ever been told one of the following? You're going to hell, you're sick, get help, or anything along those lines. I, I mean, if you're not, if you've never been told any of that, like, I don't, what are you doing with your time? Like, you're not one of the cool kids. You got Clario. She wouldn't bully anybody, but she'd bump your shoulder in the hallway by accident and you'd go to the bathroom and cry about it. I don't, who is Clario? I don't even know what the answers are. This, this is any artist that I know. Is this like all Zoomer artists that I, I don't know? I mean, I know Billie Eilish, but um, you are a liability mirror ball, messy, don't want to clean up, bad liar. I'm a bad liar, I would say. <laughs> I have no idea who these people are either. Oh, no. I thought I picked a fun quiz, but if we don't know any of the artists, um, do you enjoy being in the presence of your mother? Um, can I put, I, it's only yes or no. Mostly? <laughs> Mostly. Um, yeah, sure. I guess it's more yes than no. Do you like Andrew Garfield? Yes, he was amazing in Tick, Tick, Boom, which if you have not seen Tick, Tick, Boom, you need to rectify that. It is excellent. Okay, I got Tori Vega. This one counts because I said so. This motherfucker would absolutely drag you, and that's embarrassing coming from Tori Vega. Who the fuck is Tori Vega? I, okay, wait. I know Taylor. I know Lord. Don't know Clario. Don't know Tori, Tori Vega. M Mitski. I think I know Mitski. Azalea Banks. Definitely know Azalea Banks. Taylor and Phoebe. What's Taylor and Phoebe? And then Taylor. Why is Ta Is this Taylor Swift? Taylor Swift and somebody else named Phoebe? Is Taylor Swift on here three times? Is Taylor Swift on here three times? Okay, guys, I have a mission for you. If Lunar comes into this stream, you have to link her this quiz and see if she would get bullied by Taylor. <laughs> Taylor and Phoebe, you probably actually suck and deserve to be bullied, but Taylor would say, suck my dick, and you'd probably respond with, okay, mommy. <laughs> well. <laughs> of course, now Lady wants out the room. Hang on, guys. Go on. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. I mean, I didn't even turn on baby cam again when we switched over to this scene, but um, there's no babies anyway. So I'm sorry for that, Kitty. If the babies come back, I will turn that back on. But, uh, but right now they're in hyper play mode. I don't know how I feel about it, but okay, mommy is usually the right response. So fine. Yes, I, I, uh, I can't disagree with that. <laughs> can't disagree. Okay. All right, guys, let's, uh, let's play some Pokemon. Did everything load? Yes, okay, all my badges and stuff loaded. That's fabulous. All right, Jane! Jane, you just missed our quiz, but um, I'll, let me link it for you again, and you can find out which female artists would bully you in high school. We only knew who half of them were, so it was really fun. <clears throat> Uh-oh. All them exclamation Janes, exclamation kitties. That's fabulous, you guys. Okay, let's unpause this. And we're gonna check the volume levels. All right, I think that looks fine. If it's too quiet, y'all let me know. It might be too quiet, I'm not sure. Okay, so we switched up our team and I leveled everybody up. So to show you guys, here we go. It's peaceful, okay, good. So we've got Haley the Vulpix, we've got Politician the Gyarados still, Landon the Ivysaur still. We switched um, over to Badger the Drowsy. We've got Pinky the um, Butterfree, and we've got Taylor the Graveler. So that is our team. The game is quiet. Okay. I thought it might be. I thought it might be. Hang on.
Is that a little better, Koneko? Is that balanced a little bit better? Okay, so that's our team going into it. We're gonna basically be wrecking them all with Haley. <laughs> Kitty, thank you so much. Thank you so much for the biddies. Um, does anybody know what that's from? If you know what that's from, you get like Karen cool points, I guess. I don't know the sound and I wanted to hear it. It's an amazing sound. If you know what it's from, if you know what it's from, put it in the chat and you'll get some Karen cool points. All right, let's get them. Better. Okay, fabulous. So before they changed the um, ride at the Norway Pavilion in Epcot over to Frozen, it was like these Norwegian trolls. So the way that it works now is Elsa does ice magic and you go, you do the, the back over the falls, but it used to be these trolls and they would be like back, back over the falls and then you would do like the, you know, backwards um, descending little drop there. And I thought that ride was so cool. thought it was so cool. And it's still the same track and everything, so I guess it's still kind of cool. But it was cooler when it was like you learned about Vikings and trolls and stuff. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. It's one of those rides that they've changed that I have a soft spot for the old way that it was. It's not the only one, but it's, it's one of them. So, you know. I'm very nostalgic for 90s Epcot, I would say. Oh, welcome. I was getting bored. Okay, well, now you're not bored anymore. So I learned from last time, when I finished showing you guys the dice, I put them in my pocket so that nobody could mess with them. And then I would be forced to put them back in their, in their place where they live. So I finally did find that D10 that lady had knocked on the floor and, uh, and all that, and it turned out it was in the pocket of a hoodie that was also on the floor. And I even picked up that hoodie and like shook it out, thinking it had gotten wrapped up in there, but it didn't get wrapped up in there. It like literally went into the pocket. <laughs> so it was crazy, it was crazy. But I did eventually find it um, when I was at a totally unrelated thing. And I just like stuck my hands in my pockets because it was kind of chilly. And, uh, and I was like, what is this? What is this sharp thing? I pull it out and it's like, oh, it's the D10. Lady scored a goal. She did. She was playing. Um, she was playing dice soccer and she scored. Goal. House ghost moving things. Yeah, I have four house ghosts. They're called kitty cats. <laughs> okay, I think I have some antidotes on me, so I can just cure Haley afterwards. I think she's gonna level from fighting these guys, which is good. That's what I want. I want her to level because she's gonna get. Um, flamethrower, I think it is. Move next. Which is gonna be awesome. Ooh, she is getting too hurt though. I might have to switch to, uh, to Drowsy for the next one. Uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and pull out Badger. Ailey's health is just getting a little too low. I get a little nervous. I gotta have her to kill Erica, so. These guys are all, like, poison, too, so Badger should do a good job. Badger, 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 Badger. Oh, by the way, we only have three names left in the queue, so I went ahead and turned back on the, um, the channel point redeem so we can put in a few more names. So you guys are welcome to put in a few more, and then I will probably turn it back off so we don't end up again with a huge queue um, after you guys put some in. But that is back on. If anybody's looking for it, because we are actually down to only a few name choices. I was amazed. We actually kind of have gotten through most of them. Um, I thought I had... Can I just not read? Can I not read? Where's Antidotes? Awakening, Repel, Revive, Pearl, Ice, Heal, Super Heal, Cancel. I do not have any Antidotes. There's no way. No way! Oh, we're not naming anything right now, necessarily. I was just telling you guys that I turned the uh, Channel Point Redeem back on for naming Pokemon, if you'd like to do that again. Because I turned it off for a while because we just had so freaking many. 
I guess I really didn't buy any antidotes. It's not that I can't read. Okay, well, whatever. Let's give Haley a potion. And we'll run right over to the... the center. Ooh. This is so scary! I can't believe I didn't have any antidotes on me. How much is it taking? It's not taking off much, okay. Yes, Haley was a lunar name, yes. <laughs> Haley and Taylor are the names that she has submitted, and both of those Pokemon have ended up in my party. Alright, I think the Poke Center is back over here in this town. I don't think. Oh, it only takes one HP. Okay, so I'm fine. I'm fine, I'm fine. I just can't run around with her like this forever. Then I'm gonna go buy some antidotes before we take on more of those trainers. Yes, please heal. Heal my babies. There we go. Okay. Now to get some antidotes in case something poisons me again. Where is the mart in this town? Did I run by it? Oh no, because it's Celadon, so it's in it's the department store. Well, I was gonna go in the department store later, but I guess we're gonna have to buy some antidotes. Hello, welcome. Llama? That's a good name. I like that. Oh, here it is. Service counter, trainer's market, okay. That should be on the second floor, I think. So we'll just go up one. I think they'll have antidotes. This is a trainer's market, and if it's not here, it's gonna be on the fifth floor. Oh no, this is TMs. Not Llama, Liama. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's clever. Oh, uh, there we go. Antidotes. Gimme, gimme, gimme. I really didn't have any. I can't believe it. Yes, gimme all them antidotes. Alright. We're gonna explore the department store later. I had not intended to come in here. But I was not prepared. Okay. Back to kicking this grass gym's bootay. It's the name of one of my favorite Cirque du Soleil songs. Oh, Cirque du Soleil is so cool. I wish I could have I wish I could have seen more Cirque du Soleil shows. The only one I've ever seen is the one that they used to have at um Disney. It was at um Disney Springs, downtown Disney, that area. Uh, that's the only one I've ever seen. It's so freaking cool. Look, look, see my Pokemon. I like the grass type and they're easy to raise. Thank you so much for the lurk, Jane. We love our lurkers here. Okay, have a good shower. I'll try to not beat Erica while you're there, so shower fast. I gotta fight a few more trainers, then we're gonna go kick her booty. Super effective. Alright, level 29, that's what we wanted. Flamethrower, that's the one. Yes, okay, so... Flamethrower is... Yep, 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 yep. This is gonna replace Ember. This is basically the same thing, just better. Yay, Haley learned Flamethrower. Uh, yeah, so that let's let let's let Badger get a level. Because really the level cap's 29, so I really shouldn't level Haley anymore. <clears throat> badger, 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 mushroom, mushroom. Who remembers that? That was good times. That was a good internet when that was the kind of popular meme video. Badger, badger. All right, let's put Badger, badger in front. Kay, welcome! Welcome, welcome! Kay, I'm so sorry what you're going through with your with your graphics card. That's the worst. I'm so sorry. Honey Badger don't care video stuff. Oh my god. I love Honey Badger don't care. We had, um, Honey Badger was like such a big meme at work when that came out. Everybody would send, would send the Honey Badger video around and we talk about like who was more or less Honey Badger than others. 
<laughs> that Pokemon looks like it's hypnotizing you. It is, Kitty. It is trying to hypnotize you right now. No arc for two weeks. Kay, I can't imagine you not playing arc for two whole weeks. Like, seriously, that is unfathomable for Kay. Like, who, who, like, what? What do you do? What do you do without arc? I mean, that's like your game. That's like your jam. Mostly house renos. Oh. <laughs> well, at least it's something productive, you know? Been painting the garage. Ooh. Oh, that's fun. Are you like, um, like furnishing it? Like doing a fully furnished garage or like just repainting? Tell me, tell me. Did you know we're in the process of building a house? So like, I'm all interested in house stuff right now. Okay. Looks like there's one more trainer we need to fight. Yes. Oh no. No, there's two next to Erica, so there's lots more. Just repainting. My grandmother bought the house like 27 years ago, but never really finished the garage. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I know exactly what you mean. <laughs> this house we're in now was built in the 80s, and it's clear that somebody that lived here in the past at one point had grand ideas about um, finishing the garage and like putting up, you know, really nice walls and, and painting it and stuff. And there's like one wall that's complete and another wall that's half complete and another wall that's like not even started. That's just like the lumber pushed up against it. And I don't know if that was the previous people that lived here or if that was multiple people ago that lived here. We've never put forth the effort to finish the garage or anything like that. But um, it's just kind of, it's funny to me. It's funny to me. But uh, it's just a one car garage and we really just most just use it for storage and laundry. So... There's really not any incentive to finish it. Uh, do we want to learn Meditate? It's just gonna raise attack. I think I prefer the moves that I have right now. Excuse me. Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I probably should, because we're at the level cap now. Is there anybody that can get Weepin' Bell? I guess we can do... We can shift to Pinky and have Pinky use Confusion. When do we get a new progress pic of the house building? I just posted one today, Kitty. It is on my Instagram. It is on my Instagram. I don't want to post that kind of stuff, like, too terribly often. Because, um, you know, I don't want to attract uh, certain things, but I am putting all of that stuff on my Instagram so you can always do a look at it there. So not very many of my followers follow my Instagram, so I feel like that's kind of a more, like, small, intimate place where I can post something more personal, like house progress pictures. I'm playing a phone game and it has a deer character, and the deer is constantly referred to as a she, but the deer has antlers. Conclusion, trans deer. Well, it must be. I mean, because lady deers do not have antlers. So that's gotta be, you know, gotta have been uh, AMAB trans female deer. Ours is two car, real pain in the ass is gonna be tapping and puttying the ceiling to fill in the gaps between the drywalls. Oh my gosh, Lunar! Thank you so much for resubscribing. I love you so much. Lunar, I have to tell you. We did, the quiz today was clearly from a Swifty. Um, it was which female artist would bully you in high school and like multiple of the answers were Taylor. You've got to take it because I need to see if Taylor would bully you in high school. So I'm gonna, th thank you, Kitty. Thank you, Kitty. Perfect. Take that. Tell me if Taylor would bully you in high school or if you didn't get Taylor. I have to know. <clears throat> <clears throat> Taping and putting the ceiling to fill in the gaps between the drywall. Yes, that sounds very, very annoying, Kay. And I'm sure, like, stuff like that is why whoever started to finish the garage in our current place, like, didn't end up actually doing that. And gave up halfway through. This literally, like, one half of it, and then it's like the other half is, like, not done. It's crazy. Your razor leaf can't hurt me, Ivysaur. It's not very effective. <clears throat> Thank you, Lunar. Thank you. I have to know. 
Okay, I did see that I have paralyzed heals, so let's use those. Use that on Pinky. But other than that, I've been playing Pokemon or Candy Crush on my phone. I can't even open a graphics heavy browser. Things. Whoa! Oh no! Oh no, Kay. Um, I've been playing a lot of uh, Pokemon too. I am so addicted to Arceus. I'm um, going through and working on my Pokedex now, but I've beaten the game. I'm in the post game at this point. And it sounds like the kitties want back in, so we're gonna we're gonna let them in and hope that Lady doesn't get on a path of destruction. They got impatient and left. We bought our house in foreclosure and there was so much half finished that we've been slowly finishing. You get a good deal when you do that though if you're willing to put in the work. I am not personally willing to do that kind of work um, and neither is anyone else in my house, so. <laughs> um, but you can get some really good deals on that when you do that kind of thing. Oh my gosh, how dare you put Pinky to sleep? I know I had some awakening. There we go. Wake up, Pinky. <clears throat> oh, I didn't mean to hit back again. We're gonna confusion again. Kitty, do you have your um, kids help you with the with the house renos? I feel like that would make it easier if you can get them to do some of the some of those things with you. Not Taylor. We would be totally besties. Here's my result. Azalea Banks. Oh, Azalea Banks would bully anybody. Let's be real. <clears throat> so. I'm so sorry you didn't get Taylor. I feel like she's on there like three times. <laughs> there's like Taylor, there's Taylor Yeehaw area, and then there was one that was like Taylor and Phoebe. You probably mind your business, but get pulled into drama. Oh my, oh my. Alright, good job, Pinky. Oh, you. Alright, let's heal up Pinky. I had my kids watch, but they were too young to care. I just wanted them to see the ladies could handle the tools, too. Oh, that's nice. Okay. We have one more little trainer we gotta fight. I don't really want... I guess we can put Landon in front and let Landon, because Taylor and Politician are both going to get destroyed. So I guess Landon can go. And then we'll put Haley in front for Erica. <clears throat> so are you actually part of the process of building your new house? Yes! Um, they are they are giving, sending us weekly updates. Um, and uh, we get to make all kinds of decisions. Like, it's freaking awesome. Oh man, I put Landon out here, but this is not gonna work. This is so not gonna work. All right, um, let's do let's do Badger instead. I know he'll get a little bit over, but he shouldn't level, so it should be fine. Okay, yes, Kitty. Next next Pokemon episode, we'll do that quiz. We'll do that quiz next Pokemon episode. Oh, that's so cool. You purchase land and get contractors and show them what you want. Or yes, exactly. That's exactly what it was. We purchased a lot, and um, and we've got a certain builder that um, that's going to to build it basically. And and of course, you know, when you go with a certain builder, they have like different plans that you can purchase and different things that you can change about those plans. So it's kind of like it's kind of custom, but it's not it's not fully custom. Like you pick from their catalog, sort of, is how it works. I don't know what it would cost to get like a fully custom something something, you know. But, uh, but that's what we did. That's awesome, I always wanted to do that. I've always wanted to do it too. And the market is such that the house that we're in right now, we were, it, it's, it's gone up enough, like it's, it's worth enough, much more than what we paid for it, that um, we're gonna be able to do this and it's gonna be great. How much is it going to cost for you? I'm not gonna share that on stream. Okay, but I'm more than happy um, if you DM me and remind me. I can share you some share with you some numbers about what's normal in my area and versus what we're paying and some stuff like that. 
Uh, but I don't I don't want to give money figures live. I hope that makes sense. But I don't mind I don't mind sending them to you. So like please ask me. I just don't want to speak them over the stream. <laughs> you know. <laughs> and that goes for any of my other friends too. Y'all are welcome to ask. <laughs> it's not really private. It's not really private. I just don't. Oh my gosh! I am so not paying attention. I'm gonna get Badger killed. Ho <sighs> ho. The stupid leech seed. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Uh, go Haley. Yeah, so it's not private. Like, I don't mind you asking. Um, it's just that I save all of my VODs forever. They never go away. So, that's why. <laughs> I, I don't know what could happen later that might come back to uh, bite me. Oh my god, this confusion. Stop, stop using confusion on my people. There we go. Bye, stupid execute. Yeah, I'm pretty awesome at dying. <clears throat> yeah, Haley's a powerhouse. Okay. Uh, let's see. Do we have... No, they're not poisoned or anything. They're just low health. Oop. Where's my potions? I only have one super potion. Well, then there's no point. Let's just go back and get... Let's just go heal at the Pokemon Center. And then we'll fight Erica. Yeah, Lunar, Haley's our, our ace for this gym. Yes, I would like to cut it. Haley is going to absolutely destroy Erica. Yes, please heal them. And I gotta put Haley back in front. Taylor is our backup. And no, it's not Taylor. Badger is our backup. And then Pinky. Okay. Back into- You are just in time, Jane. We finished getting all the trainers. We just went and healed. And now we're gonna go get Erica. She won't know what hit her. Exactly! Exactly. I thought Vulpix would be a great uh, Haley. Yes, cut the tree. Lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Oh dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome. My name is Erica. I'm the leader of Celadon Gym. I'm a student in the art of flower arranging. My Pokemon are solely of the grass type. Oh, I'm sorry. I had no idea that you wished to challenge me. Very well, but I shall not lose. I think you're going to find differently, Erica. I think you're going to find differently, but we'll see. <clears throat> Did she just start with her ace? I thought her top level was level 29. So hopefully Haley one-shots everything. She should. Ah, oh, almost. Almost, almost. Ah, oh, that's so rude. Well, you just wasted your hyper potion, I think. It's okay, Lunar. Haley's gonna be fine. Haley's gonna be fine. She's championing through the Paralyze. Okay. I don't know why she started with her ace. Uh, yeah, let's switch over to Badger. Yeah, that plant was a super chump. Yeah, okay. That was her ace for sure. Because Tangle is only level 24. I 
I guess because I started with a fire type. I don't know. Maybe she normally starts with her ace, and I just didn't know that. Nope, Badger can go. Badger can go again. I don't want to risk it with Haley being paralyzed. Oh, that didn't do much. Oh, she's got two level 29s. She's got a Victory Bell and a Vile Plume. That's interesting. Ah, uh, Stun Spore again! Oh my gosh. Good thing Giga Drain doesn't do too much. <laughs> well, now he's a done guy. He went from fun guy to dung guy. I concede defeat. You are remarkably strong. I must confer on you the rainbow badge. Okay. Let me go on my thing. We're gonna turn on the rainbow badge. Boop. Got my fourth badge, guys. Okay. The rainbow badge will make Pokemon up to level 50 obey. It also allows Pokemon to use strength in and out of battle. Please also take this with you. Karen received TM19 from Erica. Put the TM19 in the TM case. Giga Drain! Half the damage it inflicts is drained to heal your Pokemon. Wouldn't you agree that it's a wonderful move? Yeah, it's a pretty good move. It's a pretty good move. Alright, we win again, guys. We win again. So let's go heal up, and we're going to explore a few things in Celadon City now that we've beaten the gym. Uh, we talked to all the people outside and some stuff like that before, but there is more to do in Celadon. It is a big city. It's a, It's got the department store, um, so it's much bigger than any of the towns that we have been to. Welcome to our Pokemon Center. Yes. Okay. We've restored your Pokemon. Yay. Okay. Um, so I think before we do that exploration, actually, I'm just gonna run over here to this route. So there's something I want to pick up from over here. Oh, there's the Snorlax. Yes, I would like to cut down this tree. So we cannot go that way quite yet. Um, are these trainers? I can't remember. Well, just in case they are, let's put Politician in front so he can get some levels. Yeah, they are. Our love knows no bounds. We are in love and we show it! Okay. Young couple would like to battle. Oh, it's a double battle. Okay. Oh, well that was smart, putting Politician in front for me. Good job. I knew they were going to be a fire Pokemon double battle. I didn't know that, I forgot. But, uh, yeah. So, this was clever of me. Gross quick attack. Nobody likes that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. Almost got Rapidash. Let's actually do Water Pulse there. We'll do a confusion on Rapidash. And it doesn't do a lot of damage for being super effective. <clears throat> oh, that's what I was hoping for. Good, good. Oh, what is our new level cap? Oh, I did not note what it is. It's probably- it's definitely like in the upper 30s though, I'm sure. So we are more than good. Okay. Bye! Bye, young couple. Yep, you're losers. Sorry! All right, let's reorganize these guys a little, because now Badger, yeah, you're good. Okay, I want to go over here. How'd you get in? Good effort. Hee <laughs> hee, I have my ways, old man. 
Oh dear, you found my secret retreat. Please don't tell anyone I'm here. I'll make it up to you with this. Karen received HMO2 from the girl. Yay, I got fly. Please put it to good use. Thanks, Firo. Alright. Um, and I just want to see... Because I cannot remember... Can Butterfra Butterfree learn it? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. So I'll have to figure out who I want to give Fly to. But we went and got it. You can do that before you get on that route properly and get past the Snorlax. Okay, let's explore a little bit. We're first going to go into here, into the Celadon Mansion. Let's talk to everybody in here, see what's up. I love Nidoran sound. You have the cutest Pokemon, lady. You shouldn't spend all your money on drinks. Try this instead. Obtain the tea. Yay, we got tea. Nothing beats thirst like some hot tea. It really is the best. I agree. I like tea. I like tea a lot. I love the Pokemon just chillin' too, kitty. They're awesome. Alright, let's see what else is in the Pokemon Mansion. Nothing over there. Is there anything over here? I think there maybe is just something on the top floor, but we're going to explore. I had tea today instead of coffee. I have to, uh, tea days sometimes too, where I might just have one coffee in the morning and then I just have tea the rest of the time. I'm the graphic artist. I drew you. So this is like the devs. It's really cute. Me? I'm the programmer. They put themselves in the game. I wrote the story. Isn't Erica cute? I like Misty a lot too. Oh, and Sabrina. I like her. Okay, I know what you're about, sir. Is that right? I'm the game designer. Filling up your Pokedex is tough, but don't quit. When you finish, come tell me. Fun fact, the tea was on in the OG game, and the OG you had to buy a drink, lemonade, or something that could create a soft lock if the player was bad enough to go completely broke. So in the remake, they added the tea. That is true, Koneko. That is true. You had to go up to the vending machine and buy lemonade and or, or water or something, and that's how this worked. Alright, this is the roof, but there is nothing on this side of it. Okay, let's go back down. Oh, I was holding the wrong button. But yes, it was possible to soft lock yourself if you somehow spent all of your money. Uh, very hard, but possible. Ah, uh, ow, I scalded my tongue. This nice old lady in the mansion gave me some tea, but it was boilingly hot. Um, okay, there's a way to get back there. Okay, there it is. We have to go up the back of the mansion. There's nothing I don't know, like I wrote on the blackboard. I know about the world of Pokemon in your Game Boy Advanced. Get together with your friends and enjoy trading Pokemon. Pokemon lecture, playing with a wireless adapter. Oh, this will tell you all about how to trade. Um, I guess if you haven't figured it out by now. But uh, we're not going to do any of that. So, we're here for this. Look what we got, you guys. Look what we got. Uh, yes, I would love to give a nickname to the Eevee. Let's see what names we've got in the queue. Pika Spray has made videos about that in similar softlocks. My favorite is a softlock where a player gets stuck in extremely powerful Mewtwo and nothing else. Oh my god! <laughs> that sounds insane. Um, okay. Let's see. We've got Teeth Fuzz, Hydration, Soggy... Uh, Liama. Hmm. I know what I'm going to evolve this into. I know what I'm going to evolve this into. So I don't want to go with Hydration or Soggy. So my choices are Liama or Teeth Fuzz. I think we're going to go with Liama. I'm sorry, Kendra. I just can't. I feel like Teeth Fuzz would have been great for a Zubat, but I just I just don't know. I don't know what I what to do with Teeth Fuzz. 
Liama. There we go. Liama. What a good boy. Yep. <clears throat> okay. We definitely want to use Eevee. So I have to figure out who I want to replace. I think probably we're going to have to retire Taylor. That probably makes the most sense. Or Pinky, maybe. But Pinky is really useful for catching Pokemon. Um, although, does Landon have Stun or Sleep Powder? Did I let her keep that? No, I let her keep Poison Powder. Because I had the Sleeper with Pinky. Well, we'll see. Yeah, that one sounds funny. I'm not familiar with that stun lock, um, Koneko. I have seen some of those. Like, I know the, the, uh, the YouTuber you're talking about. Alright. Oh. We're gonna move Pokemon. Alright. Hmm. I don't know if we're gonna make it to catching another one today, besides the Eevee we just got. So I think we're gonna switch out Pinky for now. Nope, I think we're good. Alright. And you're gonna need some levels, so we're gonna put you in front, my friend. Yeah, I linked to him on an earlier stream too. Yes, yes, I think that's why he started coming up in my suggestions because um, you had linked him. Okay, where do we want to, we want to go to the department store next? The Mewtwo one exploits the fact that Tate and Liza refuse to battle you if you only have one Pokemon. Oh, yeah, some of this is the that's the thing about like red and blue is um it has it has been played so many times, like so much that um, people have discovered everything about it. Like, the, it feels like that game is really broken, but I think it's not. I think it's just been played so much that people know all the ways to break it. For long outings, you should buy revives. Yeah, well, I'm playing a Nuzlocke, so that's not going to be helpful for me. Lishy. Okay. That's a good name. What's on this floor? Captured Pokemon are registered with an ID number and the OT. OT, OT stands for Original Trainer, the trainer that caught it first. Hi, I finally finished Pokemon. Not done yet? How about I teach you a good move? The move I have in mind is Counter. Not like the one I'm leaning on, mind you. <laughs> no, we don't need to learn Counter. Okay, I will tell you if I change my mind. Come on, Haunter. I love Haunter. I collect them. Huh? Haunter turned into a different Pokemon while being traded. Wow. All right, my buddy's gonna trade me his Kangaskhan for my Haunter. You can identify Pokemon you get in trades by their ID numbers. Okay, thank you for this useful info. I'm getting a present for my girlfriend. I guess a polka doll will be it. It's the popular thing. Then you should definitely get it. I heard something useful. If a wild Pokemon appears, you can distract it with a polka doll. You can run away while the wild Pokemon is distracted. There's also lots of weird like exploits and stun locks and things like you can get with the polka dolls. Thank you so much for the howl, Lunar. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. I imagine that howl was uh, was Haley and her in her victory against Erica. Her and Badger destroyed. Okay, so here you can buy the stones. So we definitely want to get some stones. We want to get a thunderstone. Yes. Yes. We're going to get a firestone. Yes. Oh. Uh, nope. I'm good. The Polka Doll's hilarious. Using the Polka Doll Skip Ghost Marowak is the funniest thing. Yes, I've seen that. It's ridiculous. My favorite glitches are coin case glitches, though. What's the what's a coin case glitch? Like how to get like a gajillion coins? Pokemon stat enhancers can be bought only here. HP up increases the base, base HP of a Pokemon. Calcium raises the base special attack stat of one Pokemon. Zinc boosts the base special defense stat of one Pokemon. Carbos enhancers the base speed stat. 
I'm here for Pokemon stat enhancers. Protein increases the base, iron increases the base defense. Yeah, so they'll tell you a little bit about some of those. So that's what you can buy here. So on this floor you can buy all of those that they just talked about. And then from this guy, you can get the X ones, which are just like for within a particular battle. Worse, the coin case is extremely broken so much that you can basically reprogram the game with it. Oh my god! Of course you can. Why wouldn't you be able to do that? That just makes sense. Duh. <laughs> my sister is a trainer, believe it or not, but she's so immature she drives me nuts. I'm thirsty. I want something to drink. Okay. Let's fix this child. Alright, we're gonna get a water. Oh, I didn't mean to get two waters. Soda pop. Lemonade. Yeah, I'm not thirsty. It's for this girl. Yes, we're gonna give her soda pop. I'm gonna send a funny video about coin case glitches. I love that. That sounds great. <clears throat> Light screen. Yes, we're gonna give soda pop. And that gives us safeguard. Prevent status ailments. And then lemonade. Yay, lemonade! Then we get Reflect. Weakens the power of physical attacks. Okay. Now, let's do some evolutions. Mm, where is our things? Here we go. Okay. So, this one is for Haley. Now that Haley got Flamethrower, we are ready. Okay, and we're gonna do Thunderstone on Liyama. This is our evolving Pokemon dance. It's a march. <laughs> Thank you for the how, Lunar. Jolt is not my favorite Vaporeon leafy on here. I agree. Um, Vaporeon is definitely my favorite. Um, but we have Gyarados already. Plus, if we do uh, Jolteon, then he's going to be able to learn a bug move. And that's going to be really useful against the Psychic Gym. I think that's going to be our best way to, to beat it. So that's why we're going with Jolteon. Because when I look at how I want to be able to easily beat each gym without losing Pokemon, without having to sacrifice Pokemon, I think this is the way. <clears throat> okay, so there we go. Let's rearrange the attacks a little bit. Okay. Yeah, Jill, I love the Eevee designs, they're so cool. They're so cool. I love how spiky Jolteon is. We're gonna go all the way down. Wow! Someone buy me some followers! Someone buy me some! Mm -mm 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 -mm. Let's see. There we go. Let's report them too. Okay, they are banned and reported. No worries, kitty. I got it. Bye, bot. It's even easier to spot them now that when there's a first time chatter, it pops up with like the like thing around them. I don't I don't think you guys can see that, but that's something on my end that I see in the chat when they're first time chatter. So, you know. <laughs> okay. 
Let's next actually, oh, you see it too? Okay. I couldn't remember if like you guys could see it or if just I could see it. Because when I watch other streamers, I don't notice it very much. I raked in today, if only every day were like this. I sure do fancy that Porygon, but it's hard to win at slots. So here's the prize counter for the slots. I don't have any coins, but there's certain Pokemon, of course, that you can get here. Uh, Porygon, I think this is the only way to get Porygon, and um, you can get some TMs. There's definitely reasons that you might want to get up enough coins to get some of those TMs. Um, I could see that, but yeah. Modders, readers can see it, regular chatters can't, unless they do the first timer greeting thing. Ah, got it, Koneko. That's why. No worries, Lunar. Y'all are fine. It's not a big deal. Okay, so there is a bunch of coins on the floor, and if you talk to people, so we are gonna we're gonna do that. Hey, what? You're throwing me off. Here's some coins. Shoo. Yay, thanks. What's up? Want some coins? Of course, my favorite is money. That's what I love. Give me. Games are scary. It's so easy to get hooked. That's true. They offer rare Pokemon that can be exchanged for your coins, but I just can't seem to win. These slot games, win or lose, it's only by luck. Yep. Gambling's bad, kids. Kid, do you want to play? Yeah. Thanks. I think these machines have different odds. Keep this quiet. It's rumored that this place is run by Team Rocket. What? You don't say. Welcome. Okay, so there's where you can buy coins, but we're not going to buy coins. There's some more on the floor. Um, I've got some notes here. There we go. The machines actually do have different odds. There's one lucky machine. Yes, you're right, Koneko. And there are methods that you can use um, to, to figure out which one is lucky based on what's going on with the machines around it. But it takes a lot of time and I'm probably not gonna bother. I'm just gonna pick up all these coins off the floor because I wanna show where the different hidden coins are. So that's what we're gonna do. So there's another one that's south of the right hand side. Okay. Hmm. This is the printer, right? Yeah. No, I don't need to do that. I think it might just be easiest if I just check each tile. There we go, there's more. Instead of going with the notes that I have. I know there's lots of hidden coins. There's some more. The casino never has any money on the floor when I go. I know, right? That's so cheap. They should definitely put money on the floor. It would get more people to play. You want out, Re? You want out the room? Okay. I gotta let Re out. Hang on. Give her 10 minutes and I bet she wants to write back in. Okay, anyways, as we were. I don't think there's any on the chair tiles. I'm pretty sure it's just like on the floor tiles. So we're just gonna check each of them. there. I'm rich, you guys. I got some gambling tokens. I 
I'm still totally addicted um, to Legends Arceus, by the way. Did I tell you guys that? I'm like trying, working on filling up my Pokedex and trying to figure out how the best ways to do the space-time distortions and all that stuff. It's still like super fun. I have not finished the post-game yet, but I've gotten farther in it. Just like any Pokemon game, the regular game is pretty easy, and then the post-game is really tedious, so if you love tedious shit, <laughs> which I do, <laughs> I love that sort of thing. Okay, let's talk to this guy. I'm guarding this poster, go away or else. Oh no! Oh no! I did not know that was going to happen. All right, Liyama. You can't do much yet, so we're gonna switch you out. Um, let's see. Go, Landon. I'm also hella addicted to Legends. Um, Arceus probably will be playing it all day tomorrow. Yep. I've been spending most of my free time, pretty much. Um, if it's not being spent with the husband, I'm playing uh, Legends Arceus. And even sometimes when it's being spent with the husband, I'm also playing Legends Arceus. <laughs> uh, yep. <laughs> it's good. It's really good. I just, I just really love, like, just throwing the Pokeball, you know? Just, like, actually throwing it with the controls instead of, like, you know, going through a menu and throwing it. It's just, it's so ridiculously satisfying. I just made it to the 30 area team is super overpowered. <laughs> I have four alpha Pokemon on my team, actually five now. Luxor is the only non-alpha on my team. Yeah, by the end of the game, I ended up with um, basically all all alphas as well. Like, I'd just see one, excuse me, and I would just be like, oh my god, I have to go catch the alpha. Like, they're so big. And it's just, it's so fun to have the big Pokemon. I have a couple of um, shiny alphas at this point, too, which is really fun. Oh, no. Oh, I have hiccups. I don't think Lana's going to be able to take that one. Okay. Oh no. I thought it was just a couple little hiccups. Now I think I actually have the hiccups. <sighs> I'll be replacing someone with a Riolu soon because I love Riolu and I gotta get to it first. Uh, yeah, they're pretty rare. The Riolus are pretty rare, but you can get one. For sure. Team Rocket hideout might be discovered. I better tell Bot. Ugh. Oh my god. Okay. Hey, a switch behind the poster. Let's push it. <gasps> oh my god, you got... <laughs> I have hiccups. <sighs> okay, we're gonna go to the store. We're gonna buy... <laughs> we're gonna buy a cure for my hiccups. Now we're gonna buy some potions. And, uh, so we can get ready to go in this place. Ace. <sighs> How did I get the hiccups, you guys? Was I talking too fast? I wasn't even, like, laughing or anything. I usually get the hiccups when I laugh too much. Do you guys have hiccup remedies? Tell them to me. Actually, we can get more potions. Yes. Okay, how many antidotes do I have? I have a good number of those. Thank you so much, Lunar, for contributing to finishing the Doki Doki Literature Club. Um, I will put that on the schedule as soon as we have reached our goal. Or I die of hiccups. I guess that could happen, too. Thank you. Play it at my funeral. Ugh. And tell them I died of the hiccups. Guess what, you guys? I can hear the dog outside the door. And she he wants back in. I can't believe I got the hiccups on stream. I'm dying. I'm, like, dying inside. And on the outside. And in my lungs where the hiccups are. <laughs> Thank you so much, Koneko, for adding to the Doki Doki Literature Club. Okay, let, let me let the dog back in. <clears throat> okay, she's back. <sighs> okay. Okay. 
All right, this is where we have to find the key card, I'm pretty sure. You broke into Team Rocket's operation. What nerve. Let's see. Oh, we're at 94%. We are very close. We are very close. Uh, make the hiccups go away, you guys. Maybe finishing um, the donations to Doki Doki Literature Club will make my hiccups go away. All right. Let's do some switch tripping. Oh, I should have gone to the Pokemon Poke Center before I went in here. Oh well. We didn't break in, we just pushed a button. That's true! I did nothing wrong. I pushed the button and the stairs appeared, and like, what am I supposed to do with that? You want me to not walk down the stairs that appeared in front of me? Like, are you crazy? Eat? <laughs> Go away, hiccups! When you guys get the hiccups, does it like hurt a little bit? It hurts a little bit when I have the hiccups. <clears throat> uh, no, Taylor can get that Raticate too. So if you want, of course, you can definitely come in here and do this before you beat Erica. But I wanted to beat Erica first and then come in here. Um, because I just thought that was better. And of course I spent the time in between the stream uh, doing leveling everybody up, so. Boom! At least they still let you run in here. Got the escape rope! Who are you? How'd you get in here? It was very easy. I walked down the stairs. Just like I get to any basement. Alright, let's see how much the quick attack actually does. Yeah, it does basically nothing. Okay, so I'm right to switch train until Liyama gets a better move. When does Liyama get a better move? Let's see. Jolteon. Uh, yep. I'll go look at the Bulbapedia for Jolteon. And see... Uh, yes, I will definitely change Pokemon. Let's do... let's do Politician. So, Jolteon will get... Double Kick at level 30. It missed its chance to get Thundershot because I got it to when it was too high a level. Um, Water Pulse. And it'll get Pin Missile at 36. But it won't get Thunder until 52. So it's going to be a while before it gets an electric move, which is fine. Like, I want it for the Pin Missile. That's why we did it. I wonder if I have any electric um, TMs that might be more useful so it has a decent attack. Okay, is there anything in this room? Oh, this one of the doors we can't get through. Okay. Do I have any TMs that I can teach? Mm -hmm. We've got Shockwave. But it doesn't... It's only 60 power. I mean, I guess it couldn't hurt. At least it has an electric move. <clears throat> yes, 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 yes. Alright, we'll replace Growl. Liyama learned Shockwave. Awesome. <coughs> Bless me. Uh, okay. Okay, there we go. Now maybe it can do something to some of them? Alright, let's close this page. There we go. Okay. Uh, 
Oh, the tile spin puzzle. Boss says you can see ghosts with a sylph scope. What? I want to see ghosts. I want to see ghosties. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Liyama should be able to take out Zubats, I think. Because this is electric. He's electric. Boogie woogie woogie. Yep. That Zubat got to feel it. It's electric. Uh, no, 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 no. Let's let's keep let's keep Liyama in and see how much it can do. Cause these guys seem pretty low level. Ghosts? Ghosts? Yes, ghosts. You, you can, can do, do it, Pokemon, Pokemon Karen. Karen. Get them, Get them ghosts. ghosts. <gasps> oh my gosh, you use the text to speech again, Jane. Jane, I love when you use the text to speech. It gives me such joy in my heart. <clears throat> yeah, we're gonna try to get that self scope that he's talking about. Because we need to see the ghosts. Yep. Liama's gonna be a powerhouse. I can feel it. I can just feel it. <gasps> they are gone. Lunar! Thank you for pointing that out. I don't know what got rid of them. But I'm so glad they are gone. I guess I just had to forget about them, and then they went away. They only wanted attention, and when they realized they weren't going to get enough of it, they left. I mean, that's how most things in life work, right? You just ignore them, and then the problem goes away. That's my philosophy. Works every time. Yay, level up. You want out again? Make up your mind, girl. Make up your mind. Yeah. You can't go on that one. Stick to this one. There you go. There you go. You gotta get past the door guard. There you go. Oreo has this amazing habit where he thinks he's the door guard in the house and he'll just lay in front of doors, in front of thresholds, trying to block people. Okay, here we go. This is the spinny puzzle. Let's see how much I remember of this. Yep, got the moonstone, because you have to go the wrong way a bit to get all these items. Got the X speed. Yep, got TM Taunt. Okay, now... Mm -mm -mm. I think I want to go this way. Now I think I want to go this way. Nope, that was wrong. No, maybe it was right. Ha. Huh. Um... And we're gonna go down this way. There we go. Speaking of problems that don't go away, two of our three bulbs in the light in my room went out. <laughs> oh my god, we replaced some of the new bulbs. They're a little bit tinted and have little bits of pink and purple patterns on my ceiling. Ooh, oh, that's a good problem to have. I'm in favor. I like it. That sounds awesome. Okay. I think she just wanted out to drink some water because I think Ree wants to come back in. Um, let's do this. And then we'll do this. And then we'll do this. And then we'll do this. Yay! Great success! Okay. Now I'm kind of sad that my third bulb is boring. I could replace it, but why would I? Yeah, because that'd be kind of a waste. You gotta wait for it to go out. I agree. Lights in different colors are flashing on and off. A telephone. Better not use it. Why can't I use the phone? Is that like a bad thing? <clears throat> All 
All right, we're gonna go up the stairs. Why did you come here? Because the stairs appeared in front of me, okay? And I just cannot resist the curiosity. So that's why I did. Now you can't use the phone because you're only able to call Team Rocket with it because it's Team Rocket's phone. <laughs> I think every phone in this game says that, though, no matter where it is or what the context is. But maybe, I don't know if there, maybe there's no phones except in the Team Rocket areas. I don't know. But I think every phone in this game says that if you try to go up to it. But now that, you, now that I say that, I'm like, maybe every phone is in a Team Rocket area. Maybe there's no phones outside of Team Rocket areas. I'm not sure. But who was phone? Who was phone indeed? Ring, 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 banana phone. It's cellular modular interactive modular. So this is just get Liyama levels. This area is just get Liyama a bunch of levels um, so that he can catch up to his friends. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we're doing in the Team Rocket hideout. Bye, Eradicate. <clears throat> Oh, I've used Shockwave a lot. I should start using Quick Attack when they're in the red. What's this? A Hyper Potion! Yay! <laughs> Intruder alert! Intruder alert! Danger, Will Robinson. A Grimer. I'm so glad your disable missed. That was very good. He's catching up quick. Of course he's catching up quick. He goes zoomies. That's right. He's super zoomies. He's the zoomiest. I need to draw- oh my god! Yes, Koneko, you so need to draw that. You so need to draw that. Imagine a Jolteon going zoomies, circles around an Umbreon, and the Umbreon just looking so, like, tired. <laughs> and, like, looking at it like, you need to slow down, sir. All right, <clears throat> so I think, I think if I remember right, it's best to just go back and then go down these stairs. Yep, 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 yep. This is where I want to be. We got word from upstairs that you were coming. Why didn't they come to stop me? That would be like the annoying pigeon meme. <gasps> yes! Yes, but with a Jolteon and an Umbreon. Exactly. You understand. Buy him a chop. Bye bye. Ain't no lie, baby. Bye bye bye. 
frustration. We're not experiencing too much frustration today. It's pretty good. Now, I want to say... There we go. I thought so. I came over here and it didn't trigger, but I was like, let me try again. Okay, so here's another spinny puzzle. Uh, let's see. Definitely want to go get this item. Rare candy. Mm, looks like I have to backtrack, so we're going to go back up here. And then let's go down here. Here. And then this one. So we can fight this guy. <clears throat> I remember as a kid, these spinning puzzles were so freaking annoying. I thought they were really challenging. I did not understand how to like look at everything holistically and go through all of those steps in my head. And like they would just drive me bonkers. That first one, I remember doing it over and over and over, trying to ch get all the items that were in there and just like always forgetting how I was supposed to do it and getting stuck. <laughs> ooh, ooh, a Pokemon fun fact. Okay. And Pokemon Black White gets us his hide hi I don't know how to say that Pokemon's name. Hydregion? Um, knows frustration, which does max damage, meaning Hydregion has zero friendship level that it Yes! I had heard that, which implies Getsis abuses his Pokemon. That's one of those things that's like storytelling through gameplay that I think is really, really fantastic. Apart from legendaries, the only Pokemon that starts out with zero friendship is Bunyeri. Yes, that is my understanding too. Um Hydreigon. Thank you, Hydreigon. I've been told that before and I can just I can never I can never do it. When I look at it, I want it to be different. Um, I want it to be different than Hydreigon. I, wa I like wanted an extra syllable to be in there even though it's not. Like I want there to be another I after the G, I think, is what's happening. Like I want it to be G on instead of just gone. I wonder if I have any items that'll restore PP. In German, dry is in three. That makes sense. The three heads. Okay. Do I have anything that restores PP? Yep. We can restore the shockwave. And let's give him a potion too. Oh, I don't have much friendship with this Jolteon yet. It didn't come up to me at all to get that super potion. Black glasses! Yay! That'll help with dark type moves. Max Ether. The elevator doesn't work. Who has the lift key? I wonder if he has the lift key. I realized I didn't even try to check the elevator <laughs> to show that it's down. If you try to check the elevator when you get to it at the end of that puzzle, um, it doesn't work. And so you have to go backtrack and go through the stairs. Super effective. Bye, Team Rocket Grunt. No! Oh no, I dropped the lift key. And I picked it up, and you're just not gonna do anything about that. Oh no, I dropped the lift key. <laughs> Games are silly. Alright. So, let's go back. Then we can take the elevator now. Oh, wait, I have to go back to the floor that actually has the elevator. 
this one. Mm, I think I took the wrong way. Mm, no, no, no. I can go this way. There we go. Spinny, spinny. Imagine playing like a um, first person version of Pokemon and you do the spinnies in that thing. Somebody made a video for that and it's like, is like, <laughs> it is like stomach churning. Uh, okay, we need to go to basement floor four. Yeah, 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 yeah. I thought of something else related to Getsis. His theme has the same drum motif as the unused Arceus theme from Diamond Pearl Platinum, which makes the sneaky implication that Getsis is a god complex. Ah! Oh, I love that. That's nice. Calcium. Of course Getsis has a god complex. How can you not see the beauty of our evil? Well, when you asked me to join Team Rocket, I said yes, and then he acted like I didn't say yes, like I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that information. It's like you made the offer, but that you weren't really interested, so like... What does it mean? What does it mean? I tried. Okay, I tried. But I feel rejected. So, now all of your Pokémon have to die. It's just how it is. You don't tell me no. Uh, yes, actually. I don't think Jolteon's gonna do much with a sand true. <clears throat> Honestly, out of all the Pokemon villains, Getsis is the most terrifying. Yep, because he's a genuinely horrible person. He doesn't just have the authority complex or strange ally doesn't... He legit abuses N in his Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that's part of why um, my second favorite generation is Gen 5, because of um, Black and White. I just, I think that game is, it's just so good. You know, the story's so good. Um, it's so interesting. It's so, um, I, I love that it's all new Pokemon, you know, instead of repeating Pokemon from previous regions. Like, it's just, it's good. You know, I got a lot of hate when it came out because it was so different. Um, it was more focused on the plot. And we didn't get any of our favorite Pokemon back, really, in the main story. And so people were really raging about that, but I, I found it so refreshing. It's, like, so refreshing. I, I wish they would have focused a little bit more on the story in subsequent generations, because I feel like Pokemon's story most of the time is pretty weak. And especially after Gen 5, the the mainline Pokemon get pretty weak stories. Um, I've really enjoyed the story in uh, Pokemon Legends Arceus. I'm not going to say too much because I don't want to spoil it for you too much for you, Kaneko, but um, I, I find it really interesting. The themes are good. Um, some of the characters are just okay, but some are pretty good. Um, I mean, it's still a Pokemon game. It's not fantastic from the story perspective, but it's it's good. It's not bad. You know, it's interesting. Gen 5 is my favorite. There's a lot of weak spot for Gen 4. Gen 5 is just too good. I understand. Yep, I totally get that. Um, for me, it goes like Gen 1, Gen 5, and then like everything after that is just like, it's not even really ranked. I just, those two are my favorite by far. It's just not, it's not even a contest for the others. Oh, that's a sand true. I gotta switch, I gotta switch. Uh, come on, politician. Adaman is the best boy and I love Polo so much. I love Adaman too. Adaman is great. <laughs> uh, big, big soft spot for Adaman. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, let's switch back to Liana. It's a good sound effect there, right there. Really good sound effect. Uh, yes. Let's switch back to politician. Mm 
And after this, it should be the last room. Oh, I meant to use Water Pulse, not Bite. Oops. Oops. I pressed the button too quick. There we go. Bye, Sand Slash. Good job, politician. <clears throat> Burned again. Okay, so once that door is open, um, we're gonna fight the boss here. Let's see who it is. Mm, I don't know, I probably don't need to heal him. He's not got that much damage. So I must say, I am impressed you got here. Team Rocket captures Pokemon from around the world. They're important tools for keeping our criminal enterprise going. I am the leader, Giovanni. For your insolence, you will feel a world of pain. All right, all right, all right. Come at me. Come at me. What's up, Daddy? Boss Giovanni would like to battle. So far, I really adore the legend story. Yeah, oh yeah, oh, I already read that. Yes, yes, yes. It's, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. I am into it. Super effective. One thing I'm wondering about, though, because I haven't seen this being a thing in, like, at all, why do Aura Guardians not exist? Like, we obviously have the 8th movie, and Gen 4 has Riley, who is implied to be an Aura Guardian in the games. The Grand Sprite animation shows a little aura. Um, and confirmed to be one in the anime, but then the whole plot point is just forgotten, like even other plots involving Riolu and Lucario. Ash is, as far as I know, never shown to be able to use Aura, even though he was in the movie. <laughs> yeah, they do kind of, like, uh, get rid of that out of nowhere, don't they? Um, yes. For Kangaskhan... I don't really have anyone super good for Kangaskhan. I guess we can continue... Well, no. Let's do... Let's let Haley. Let's let Haley go. It's such an interesting lore thing. They really should have brought it back. Yeah. Um, I feel like that happens a lot with Pokemon. That, um, you know, the, the lore and the plot is just not really a huge focus. And so sometimes things get, like, dropped or forgotten. And it's just a little bit weird. Oof. Oof, that hurts. Okay. Um, maybe Haley was not a good choice. I just don't really have anything that's going to be good against Kangaskhan. Okay, let's switch over to, I guess, Taylor, because Taylor's at least bulky. Oh no! Oh no, I used Mega Punch! Oh, it's not very effective. Oh, good, good, good. Whew! I got a little nervous there. I didn't know what that was going to do to Taylor. Oh man, Magnitude doesn't do shit! Uh, let's see. I guess we'll switch over to Liyama. A Mega Punch is normal. Okay, it's not a fighting move. Whew. Whew. I was like, I didn't think Kangaskhan had me fighting moves. When I saw the word punch, I was like, oh no, it's a fighting move. Oh no, it's a fighting move. I did get a horrible roll, but still, it still did less than I thought it should have. Whatever, this should kill it. There we go. Bye, Kangaskhan. I will now have to proceed to write Legends Arceus fanfiction that involves Aura Guardians. I can focus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, since Legends Arceus came out, you know, of course, that Pokemon role plays are. I'm seeing some of those pop up. So if you're interested in like a group, you should browse through some of the groups that are advertising. Not in the cafe. I haven't seen one in there, but like in other larger um, hub servers. I've seen, I've seen some pop up. I see that you raise Pokemon with utmost care. A child like you would never understand what I hope to achieve. I shall step aside this time. I hope we meet again. And he was so, he was so shocked. He also dropped something out of his pocket. That's a problem with these rocket types. They just, they're constantly dropping stuff from their pockets. You know, it's a big problem. It's a big problem. Okay, we can leave now. We can go back down to one. 
I'm not interested in Pokemon. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's fine. Fair. A lot of them have, like, specific mechanics for the Pokemon anyways that can be kind of, like, you know, not so. They can be, like, too crunchy for, for me for a text-based roleplay, you know? Politician gonna do much against a grinder? Let's find out. Oh no, not minimize. Not minimize. <sighs> this better kill it. Whew. Oh my god. I have flashbacks. I have flashbacks to that muck. Minimize and me, we're enemies. We're enemies. Not here for it. Not here for it at all. Good, good. I like it when you miss coughing. Bye, Grunt. Alright. We Audi 5000. Actually, I don't think... Is there one more... Oh, nope, nope, nope. Go down. I just want to check something. Okay, no. We're good. I get everything I wanted from out of here. We're back to the fun music. Alright, let's go heal up. So now that we got the Sylph Scope, that is everything we need to do in Celadon. Yes, please heal my babies. Please heal them. Alright. Alright. Let's do this. I need to double check what my next level cap is. I think it's the, either we can fight Koga or Sabrina next. But I think I'm gonna go go to Koga. So let's see what his ace is. Um, what level his ace is? I think they're the same. Yeah, Koga's and Sabrina's ace are both level 43. So I've got a really long, yeah, and there's lots of like, okay, 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 we're, we're good. We're more than good. We're gonna go back this way. It's more self-indulgent and control-based for me. That tea looks awfully tasty. Huh, can I have this drink? Gee, thanks. Glug, 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 gulp. If you want to go to Saffron City, you can go through. I'll share this tea with the other guards. Okay, so now we can get into Saffron. We're actually not going to explore Saffron right now. I want to go back to Lavender Town, but we've got it unlocked, so we can actually go there at this point. Um, but I just don't want to go there quite yet. I like to do Fuchsia City first and then Saffron City. It's more self-indulgent and control-based for me. I want to be able to see, be as self-indulgent as I want. Yeah. And one-on-ones, you can be the most because you only have to answer to that one person, period. Nobody else. All right, we running, 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 running fast like lightning. Yeah. All right, we're back in Lavender Town. Let's see. So I have Badger. Should do a really good job against all of these guys in here. So we're gonna get him lots of levels. I came to pray for my dearly departed Clefairy. Sniff, I'm awash in tears. Did you come to pay respects? Bless your Pokemon loving heart, girl. Aw, oh, thank you. My Growlithe, why did you die? I'm a channeler. There are spirits up to mischief. I sense them high in the tower. 
Pokemon Tower was erected in the memory of a Pokemon that died. I currently have a Legends RP going on with a good friend. We're playing Pokemon, trying to get used to weird humans. It's funny. Ah! <laughs> oh, that's a good plot. That's a good plot. Okay. Here we go. You see him? You see him? Uh, let's do... Let's start with Haley, actually, for him. Alright. Sorry your internet's being so crappy today, Koneko. Hey, Karen, what brings you here? Is your Pokémon dead? Hey, it's alive! I can at least make them faint. Let's go. Alright, Booty. It's time. I feel like the way this is intended to go is you're supposed to find him, like, before you realize you can't progress here and you have to go get the Soul Scope and stuff, so I think his Pokémon are fairly low level. At this point, anyway. Compared to mine. But we'll see. I think they are. I think this is gonna be an easy one. Watch me say that and then things go horribly, horribly wrong. Yes, I will switch Pokémon. Go, land in. Get that Gyarados. I have a Gyarados, too. You're not the only one. That's an annoying move. What? My gosh. There we go. That second Razor Leaf should have killed him. It's very rude that it didn't. Uh, yes. Let's get Haley back out for Execute. <clears throat> I don't want to mess around with that one. needs to die fast so it doesn't do weird annoying psychic things to me. There we go. Good job, Haley. Good job. Keeping us from annoying execute. Uh, yes. Let's see. We will go back to Politician for Kadabra. Yeah, his cadaver's only level 20. Oh no! <gasps> Disable actually worked! I cannot believe it! There we go. Bye, Kadabra. Uh, no. Politician can stay out. Oh, right, Water Pulse is disabled. Shoot! Oh, I probably should have swapped then. I don't know. I don't think his Charmeleon has much against... this gonna do against a, um, Water-type. Oh, there we go. It's not disabled anymore. Yeah! Super effective! Good job, politician. Uh, no. I don't need you to learn Leer. Leer. It's fine. You don't need that. All right, Booty, you are no longer rocking everywhere. How's your Pokedex coming? I just caught a Cubone. I can't find a bigger Marowak. Where could they be? I bet there aren't any left. Well, I better get going. I've got a lot to accomplish, unlike you. Smell you later. Whatever, dude. I'm gonna be the champion. You only get to be the champion for like 0.5 seconds, because I take it from you so fast. All right. Let's see if we can get a little ways through the Pokemon Tower. Oh, dead end. I don't know if we'll finish this before the end of stream, but we can at least get a little ways. Even if we could not identify the wayward ghosts, a Silphscope might be able to unmask them. Hmm. Well, what do I have? 
I have a self scout. Oh yeah. Ha, huh, there's gonna be a catch here. We can get a Pokemon. I should have brought my Butterfree to put it to sleep. What do I wanna do? What do I wanna do? I wanna go back. I wanna go back and get Butterfree. So I can put the Pokemon to sleep and catch one. I ran the wrong way. There we go. <clears throat> All right. Come on, Butterfree, I need you. And we're gonna put Taylor. Welcome back. You haven't really missed anything. Um, we did our the rival battle. But because, uh, I think, I feel like you're intended to do this rival battle before you go beat Erica. Um, he was pretty underleveled. Let's see. Okay. And I think, and we're gonna go catch another Pokemon. Or we should. One thing that kind of weirds me out about the first generation is they have this whole area that's in regard to ghost Pokemon, but there's only like one ghost Pokemon. <laughs> and it's not even ghost, it's like ghost poison. So it's like so weird to me why they did it like that. I feel like there should be more ghosts in the first generation since they have this whole area. Come on. I know there's Pokemon here. I don't want to fight any of them yet. Hmm. Well, I guess we'll do this. Maybe I have to go up another floor to do the catch. Chandler Hope would like to battle! Badger should just destroy everything. Because they pretty much all have Ghastlies. In this little area, all the Chandlers. Because again, there's not another ghost Pokemon in this game. Which doesn't really make super sense to me. Okay. Yeah, maybe there's no encounters on this floor, but I don't want to be caught unawares and miss my chance. So we're going to put Butterfree in front until we get close to the next... Okay, there are encounter encounters. And there we go, there's my Ghastly! Ghost types are really underappreciated in this game. Like, there's this whole section on them, and then it's just like... There's only one type. I feel like there should be a couple of ghosts, you know? There should be a, a, at least two ghost types. But there's not. Alright, let's get us a ghastly. Wow! <laughs> I thought that Great Ball would catch it since the Pokeball didn't, but maybe let's go back to Pokeballs. We'll alternate. We'll alternate and see what happens. I might have to damage it a little. I don't want to. I'm nervous to. You know? Today in Lucky has random thoughts. I own a Lucario plushie that has toe beans, and now I'm trying to remember if Lucario has toe beans in the anime. I don't think it does. Oh, I don't know. I'm sure you could find um, something on that, though. Oh, gross. Okay. Well, it damaged itself some, so maybe if I put it back to sleep and throw a Pokeball now, it'll work. Oof, I don't like that. Okay, let's do a great ball. Health, health, and asleep. It should catch now. There we go. 
Ghastly was caught. Yes. Okay. Here we go. Guys, we're going to do it finally. It's been sitting in the queue for a while. We're finally going to use Teeth Fuzz. I think that's appropriate for Ghastly with its teeth sticking out like that and it's kind of fuzzy around it. So, if Kendra's in the chat, guess what, Kendra? It's happening. Teeth Fuzz. Okay, that looks spelled right. There we go. All right. I think that's a great place to end. So, let's run back. We're gonna put, um, put Butterfree back in the PC. And, uh... And now we have Teeth Fuzz, guys. Now we have Teeth Fuzz. And we'll actually do the Pokemon Tower next stream. Alright, let's heal everybody up. Yes. We're gonna do Bill's PC. Yep, and let's get Taylor back. And do that. Okay. So I will probably get Teeth Fuzz <laughs> up to match. I might get everybody just a couple of levels, get them all up to 30, just so that they're not too far behind. I have so many Pokemon now. I've been doing I've been doing too good, you know. <laughs> um but uh, but I won't be doing too much grinding anything or anything like that in between. Like I don't think I'm gonna touch my party Pokemon, like they're fine. I'll level them up as we go. Oh, Lucario does have Tobeans. Interesting. Oh, that is interesting. Tobeans are the best. Tobeans are awesome. Uh, log off. Okay. Let's switch back over to webcam. Oh, I need to save. Actually, let's save my game. Yes, I would like to save. Alright, and then... We're going to make a backup. All right, we can close that. Okay, guys, so next time, oh, the baby cam is still on on this scene, but it's just the stuffed animal cat. Oh, well, sorry. <laughs> Um, next time we are going to be taking a small break from our Nuzlocke and we are going to be doing our late Valentine's Day stream. It's February and, um, and I, that feels, that feels right. I didn't do it, you know, on closer to Valentine's Day, but we're going to do it next time. And it is going to be playing through blind. I love you, Colonel Sanders, which Kendra just bombarded me with those memes when that was popular. And so we're going to play it. We're going to play it. We're going to see how that goes. <laughs> um, and uh, because I've really enjoyed when we have played um, dating simulation games together on stream. So that's what we're going to be doing. Let's see. Who do we want to raid into? Oh, Declarify is doing 10 too. You know, since we beat 10, you guys would probably love to see some 10 too. So I think we're, we'll raid into him for that. Um, also, I will say that on um, Saturday for Interstage Window, we're going to be talking all about Hamilton. Um, I am kind of a Hamilton hater, a little bit, and Landon loves Hamilton. So if you would like to see us uh, talk about that and where we agree and disagree about the, this musical that uh, just took the country by storm when it came out and everyone freaking loved it, and I did not. <laughs> Join us on Interstage Window. 
Um, here's all my socials, how you can follow me and support me. I do things very similar to other content creators. I upload all of my VODs to YouTube, so you can find them there. Um, Twitter is the main social media that I'm active. You're welcome to join the Discord. It's a roleplay help Discord, but it's also for my content, Landon's content, and Kendra's content. And then if you want to make sure you know where I am on everything, you can check out my card. That is always updated with the latest links of all the places to find me. All right, guys. Um, thank you so much for joining me today. Uh, I will see you on Saturday or Thursday, whichever. And of course, don't forget, as always, to make it a great day. Have fun watching the Final Fantasy X too. All right, let's raid. Bye, guys. See you later.